Ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, our product diversity at Daimler Buses has always been great and it's getting better and better. Whether for short or long journeys, for just a few or many passengers, for robust applications or highest requirements, our customers can be sure that Daimler Buses has the right products for them. That applies to our proven product technologies and services. It also applies to the key future issues, such as electric, connected, and autonomous driving. We also want to harness these technologies for our customers. We've already shown in recent years what our vision of the autonomous and electric bus looks like and what role connectivity can play in our business. Now we are translating and implementing these visions step by step into tangible products. For the public, the waiting time may sometimes feel long. For us, however, it is a phase of intensive development and trials. Because, after all, our motto in electric, automated um, or connected driving is no different than before. It is Daimler Buses, Best Buses. And that means we only hand over our products to our customers when they're ready. When they have the quality and level of maturity and reliability our customers expect from us. And we are proud um, uh, that at this, year, at this IAA preview we can already present quite a few things that meet those requirements. Let's just take connectivity as an example. From the fourth quarter onwards, we will provide our customers with a service that is more than just useful. It's called Omnibus pl uh, Omni Plus Uptime. Operators have real-time transparency of the state of all Mercedes-Benz and Citra vehicles equipped with the necessary hardware that is the bus data center. You will be in immediately informed if there is a need for repair or maintenance. Necessary repairs can be bundled with pending maintenance and scheduled in time by the Omnibus, uh, OmniPlus service. And you receive clear recommendations for action if a breakdown is imminent. This will enable our customers to increase operating lives of their vehicles while reducing the total cost of their fleet. We developed OmniPlus uptime in close cooperation with our Mercedes-Benz truck colleagues. Mercedes-Benz uptime has been in use very successfully for quite some time in this division, and I'm sure our customers will more than welcome the service as well. I can assure you at this point in time that we have many other products and features in the pipeline that um, will make our customers' life um, a lot easier by using smart data, and we'll keep you posted. Now, let's move on to the next topic of the future, that is electric driving. What I said at the beginning of my talk also applies here. We have a clear vision and we're going to start serious production now. And this comes in the form of our second world premiere today, this, the e Sotero. Ladies and gentlemen, about four months ago, we presented this post to you for the first time, but at the time, it was still camouflaged. Today, our baby not only gets a face, but also a name, and a very logical one, Isotero. With this name, we underscore two things. First of all, our customers will find everything they value in the conventional Sotero. And secondly, the little E indicates the big difference. The drivetrain is fully electric on the Isotaro. In addition to name and design, we'd like to introduce um, you to a third aspect that's of great importance in relation with our electric buses. That's the drivetrain and charging concept that we've planned for our buses. You heard me say that correctly. We will offer more than one battery concept. And we'll do something else that's unusual. We'll show you today what we intend to do in the next few years. That we'll continue to improve the range of our Isotaro and the te technology paths we will take to do so. Why are we doing this? Quite simply, we want to give our customers, the municipalities, planning security. It is crucial for us that our customers know that with us, they can plan their transformation to electromobility over the long term. Joseph Tushin will have all the technical details for you in just a second. 
Ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, we're thinking both long-term and holistically. Although when one manufacturer or the other might sometimes be faster than we are, our rationale is and remains reliability over speed. That also means we won't leave our customers alone with the new technology. You know, as well as we do, um, electromobility means much more than just charging the battery and driving off. Our customers may face many questions when switching to e-buses. For instance, can an electric fleet cover the existing route network? Can all buses be recharged at once? How does maintenance work? in e-buses. Our in-house e-mobility consulting helps our customers to find answers to these and other questions. In order to do so, we look at the operational processes together and optimally match the vehicle configuration and the charging infrastructure to the routes, timetables, topography, and the required range. And we're working on many other products and topics, including um, support with the required IT systems and energy management. As you can see, we want to be a partner to our customers, a partner with whom they can master the transition to electromobility as smoothly as possible. Ladies and gentlemen, You've already heard a lot about it, now you should see it too, our e-Citaro. The first electric uh, bus by Mercedes-Benz, for the first time completely unmasked, ready for use in our cities and on our roads. This is really a special moment for all of us, and I think there is one person who is especially proud, our head of development, Gustav Tuschen. He was a key driving force in the development of our e-Citaro, and now he will introduce you to the bus in full detail. Ladies and gentlemen, let's welcome Gustav Tuschen and the new Isotero. Thank you.